Hello, Schmodown faithful. Uh, I, I am Clark. your commissioner, Clark Wolf. I hope you are all enjoying the spectacular. <laughs> this has been a tough year to say Good the to least, uh, but we wanted yep. to thank you for proving once again to be the great fan base that we know you are. We didn't have any live events this year. We didn't have any studio matches, but we had you. There was like you were with us year. for we're all of the, the tournaments yeah. and <laughs> turns we had along the way. We also wanted to thank the competitors. They stepped up and went above and beyond. Teams, singles, IG, and Star Wars. So I'll be honest, Star Wars is not the category I know the most about, but I was on the edge of my seat for these matches and the Star Wars competitors showed us just how intense digital schmodown matches could be. And one of those competitors is the hunter, Andrew DiMolanta. Hi, Andrew, welcome. Oh, cool. Thanks I'm for having me. So, Andrew, you had a great run today. You battled I wonder a if really, they had really him watching it in the background. Match. And oh, yeah, it probably. been me. Should That's be. probably why they had the shot of Call the Corruption. Excuse folk. me? Uh -huh. I, I should be competing against Alex the Spectacular, to be honest. Ace got lucky in our match. It was such a fluke that he beat me. Honestly, if I was going up against Alex at Spectacular, yeah, I would be setting him. up what, I would um, be him. It's such, it's, it's a joke. Right, uh, right, right. But weren't you Christian awarded a title shot, um, even though you lost in the, the finale of the tournament? Oh, nice. Yeah, I didn't ask for it, but, you know, to be honest, to be fair, honestly, I think what the fans would have been want, like to see a uh, triple threat between me and Alex and, and Damon. That would have been fun. I, I think I deserve it. I just, you know, that's that'd be Is fun. Is that what they're right? doing? Okay. I'm down. You know, Andrew, um, thank you I'm for, down that for that feedback. I'm yeah. so glad that you said those words. The triple threat. So, if I may, oh. Molly, Laura, Hi. welcome. Hello, Molly, Andrew. Hi guys. What, what, what's what's going on? What 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 is this? Are you going to make me compete against these two in a triple threat? I already got a title this, shot. Do you This is this is me acknowledging who I believe was the best in the tournament. Now, I know that Christian already gave you a title match. So, the league will honor that. However, Molly, Laura, what you all did in this tournament was exceptional. Next season, you two will play each other in a number one contender match. Mm, yeah. And we will give Alex Damon the opportunity to defend his title against DiMolanta, and then one of you would get the winner. Or, if Alex <clears throat> chooses to, he can defend the title in a triple threat against the winner of you two and DiMolanta. Ooh, whoa, 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 like whoa, 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 No, what, what do we, what is this? What is this? What, this is not fun. It's not fair. What, what, what is this? What's wrong, Andrew? Are you not ready that's to face wrong. me again? Um, God, I love Laura I mean, as a heel. That's me not too. set in stone, Laura. You have to. I mean, I just love first. Laura, period, but I love her as a heel. <laughs> oh, oh, Molly, that's adorable. Uh, but you and I both know that this title is mine. Andres clearly proved his win against me was a fluke, and Andrew okay. already beat you, I have Molly. A, oh, and Andrew, um, did I you end up just watching the Clone Wars on repeat? Yes. If anyone is going to be, I mean, Alex I can't Damon, hear you over one winning Molly the tournament, Damon. Laura, or even if you want to be the shortest match on the All right, that's that's enough. So there you have it. Next season, Molly will face Laura Kelly in a number one contender match. Alex Damon will decide if he wants to face DiMolanta alone or defend in a triple threat. I'll see you next season. Yeah. And I love welcome how that's back, a movie now. trivia Schmodown fans, and once again, congratulations to Alex, Damon, and the Rockstars for the big victory oh. there. But Rockstars, they ain't done yet, not by a long shot, Mark. No, they are not, Christian, because right now, Roxy Stryer goes from one champion to the champion. That would be Chris Jericho looking to avenge his loss to Kevin Smith earlier this season. But boy, does he have a foe in store for him. 
in the guise of Brittany Young. So you talk about the world of wrestling clashing, Christian. Now, sure, Chris Jericho has gone on to be a rock icon as well. But Brittany Young, look at what she's been able to do in the showdown. Look at how competitive she is. Look at how much movie knowledge she's displayed. Even though she suffered a tough loss to Jader Paramo earlier this year, I think Brittany Young has the goods. You know where you love her from Glow, but you also respect her for her work in the showdown. With Chris Jericho, he took Smith to the limit. Sad Beyond that it, actually. Glow. Four questions oh, yeah. in the sudden I, I didn't death watch what the it took Kevin Smith to fell Jericho. Will we get a similar tight <laughs> battle here today? There's only one way to answer it, it's Christian, good. and that's to it's get this baby underway. It's based on an underway. actual wrestling I can't wait to get underway because 80s. of exactly what you uh, just said. Jericho, we know how competitive he is, that. and we know how competitive Brittany Young is. Not only does she have that great match in that Glow match with Clark Wolf and how she kind of shined as a superstar there, and as you mentioned, the great match for Peron so what will this battle be like we don't know we do know that jericho wants to get back to that kevin smith rematch so this is a big thing for him here today to defeat Brittany young but i don't think Brittany young and the dungeon are going to make that easy but we're going to see how we got here right now dungeon yeah <laughs> super excited you came in and talked to us for this long i'm ready for my schmodown invite they're my second favorite oh my are you kidding uh, tomorrow yeah, champion of his industry, and now a certified rock god going up against director, producer, actor, Mr. Kevin Smith. I'm eating carrots, that's why I've muted myself Kevin in between. Oh. I love that. I would come back only if uh, Roxy's my manager. I'm team. I'm team rock stars for life. Hundred out of hundred times, baby. I'm Lulu Trivia Showdown fans. When I announced that Chris Jericho was coming to the rock stars, you all thought it was some novelty draft. You thought there's no way he's ever actually gonna play. She's just signing him to have a big name on the rock stars. But of course, as you guys usually are, you were wrong. So it was only a few months ago, one of the biggest travesties in Schmodown history took place. Once again, how am I on Schmodown movie trivia versus Kevin Smith? And the topic is Kevin That's Smith. One of the top Kevin Smith had the audacity to put his own name on the yeah, wheel. I mean, who home? does that? Oh, it's not going to happen again. I Brittany Young, I will not go 0-2. Oh, Sherry Bob! Sorry, I, I can't hear you over the page. Brittany. The cherry bomb young is the most dynamic, most electrifying Sorry, professional wrestler competing in the movie trivia showdown well, today. Is it a Brittany time, brings like one? It's like a sunshine. I don't know how to explain yeah. it. A glow. That's a good word. Oh, yeah. Glow. Yeah, hey, showdown fans, it's your girl Brittany Young from the dungeon. I am so glad to be back here at Showdown for my next match in the spectacular against my man Chris Jericho. The guy's nickname is Le Champion. Yeah which I believe is Canadian for turnbuckle head. Ah! Once he puts I his mind to something, so he doesn't much. stop he'll, until he's the champion. And the fact that Kevin Smith doesn't want to play him again shows you that he's really afraid. And I guarantee you that match round two will be Are happening. Are you rooting for your fellow point. Canadian or not? uncrowned yeah. king of the Schmodown. If I can yeah, almost yeah. beat Kevin Smith, Brittany, imagine what I can do to you. Now see, he was I'm born sure in America, but yeah, he was to he's talk, like, you know, but I'm not in the Canada. Just want to come out here, have a good time, casually drop that I graduated from USC film school, didn't play sports growing up because I was watching TV all the time. Really just here for the positive vibes and to show Chris what it's like to be in the dungeon. He is the greatest of I all time. Brittany Young, I'm wrestler, sorry, honey, you're just collateral really damage because we got to make our way through you. <laughs> and Kaiser, nice of you to show up. I kind of forgot that you even managed in the movie Trivia Schmodown anymore. I mean, where have you been? You're talking about my SAT scores? You're not wrong. <laughs> but when it comes to managing in the movie, Kaiser Snow was down, hands down one of the, the guy that fun, most fun friend. we had on the street. And that's why doing an interview. the Cherry Bomb Young is going to oh, blow up. One of the worst. Uh, Jericho today. And with, um, Please help me. Because I have to win. Oh, what's the name or else of Roxy it? will not let me eat my I'm dinner. Gonna... I'm hungry. Let me think for a Get second. Ready. I'll be right back with my thoughts. <laughs> Worries. Speaking before Brain is like, wait, what? Hopefully 50 comes back. Well, I mean, he's still got time. They still got to do the intros and stuff. Look, Mark, and as we as we see, you know, this is a big one for Roxy as she is making a play for manager of the year. Kaiser wants to go out. He didn't have a great season this year, so he wants to go out with the victory. This is yeah. the last match we're going to see of Kaiser and the Dungeon sure before we head into season right, eight. So this is a big one. Um, 
Yeah, I mean, it's Shmodown, almost like a team that uh, knows that they're not going to be in the playoffs, but you still want to give right. your fan base so the a little bit of momentum Shmodown going into the offseason and then season eight, like you said, right around the corner. Wow. And so without yeah. further That's ado, a show I, have I think not it's heard time anything to get from in Roxy Stryer in here and to get her they're pretty good. They're pretty good. Heiser. So I was going to say, are they still around? Because I haven't seen Where do you want to begin with these two they, um, well, I'm going to start with Roxy. That was six days cold. ago was for it's the bad Ultimate Shmodown show. Well, it's it's well, just because I haven't seen their posts in, like, the groups or anything. Well, yeah, so, awesome. Roxy. Thank Rox you for that, Kaiser. Brilliant for what? Okay, okay. Well, this, this is not going to be... The dungeon, you know, he lost the manager, John, to help the kid out. That's well, not Brandon Adams. Stop that. So, Roxy Stryer, yeah, you're coming Roxy's off a massive win here in the Star Wars today. division. Yeah. You have a in kind Boston. of a pep in your step, in if you will, a brilliant second half of the season. She's in Boston, and now Chris but Jericho is she in space goes up Boston against Brittany Young. How Bill is Burr's the champion the doing nice. preparing for this match? He's doing incredibly. I mean, I do. I am curious how my, much I owe you and Mark and Rand. One of my favorite I threads that I saw now. on I mean, Twitter. Spectacular is. Mine. Uh, the, I'm here all I'm day, sorry, but Bill Burr's so, accent in Star Wars implies some sort of space Boston. So when he is incredible, replies that Star he's Wars. watching movies left and yeah. right. He's got the Someone knowledge, replies, and he really doesn't like I wasn't like a second stormtrooper. Once, and I don't think he's gonna get it. That's awesome. Yeah. And someone yeah, goes, my ship Kaiser, is called the Wicked Pisser. There's going to be pizza. some trash talk here, not only between you and, and Roxy, but also Chris and Brittany Young. So do you have to talk to Brittany, Young, so to talk to Brittany about taking <laughs> those bars from Jericho, or do you think <laughs> that she is able to return fire just fine? Yeah. You know, for being one Apple of the living bitch. legends of pro wrestling, <laughs> Chris Jericho certainly has zero sense when it comes back. to selecting managers. I mean, Roxy Stride has never won anything in her life. Except maybe the hearts and minds of some of the dumbest fans in the movie trade. Hey, Shimoda. now back in 1981, like Kaiser. Chris Jericho was my favorite wrestler, right up there with Dirty Dick Slater. Now that's in a, a name a drop close from the past. So, you know, I still want to honor Chris in some way. So at first, see, I that's thought, one of the well, things I learned when we were talking to Kaiser is that Canadian he brings nationally? a lot of that oh, wrestling element to the there because he grew Canada, up with right? these wrestlers. But nobody yeah, cares. Yeah, I guess in the off season when he wasn't even referee, he was a wrestler. Yeah, so when, he was, uh, when he wasn't an umpire, was he was a wrestler, and then and they to told him that he, he had a mask on, his father, Ken Kaiser, right, well, and then his mask Canada was taken off by one of his opponents, this match. Yeah. and they really realized that it was him, and MLB told him you can either wrestle or you can be an umpire, and then he chose umpiring. Yeah, when he told me that like one of his dad's best friends was Bobby Heenan, my mind exploded. And then when he told me where he got the the well from, I was like, Rocks, so you know that. Should have fucking seen it from the Road I Warriors. I like Brittany a lot too, yeah. but I'm a Road Warrior. Right, Road Warrior Hawk. I was like, man, sorry, duh. Brittany. Look at me next. But yeah, season. in the baseball we'll scene, his father Ken right, Kaiser well, the, is you knew that was gonna happen to him. Good yeah. luck to both, <laughs> yeah. both Kaiser and, um, and Roxy. Of, Roxy does have a point. I've thought Rockstar's about getting his book better, but this is it. And I don't know if you want to piss Jericho off before you get into a match. If you want to ask anyone anything, any question about baseball ever, my dad knows everything about baseball. This is the one I've been waiting for. K, have at it, Golden Throat. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time for the movie trivia showdown at the draft. Intro and because it's a Bobby Heenan jacket, and I was like, "That's not the real one, is he?" He says, "No, it's a replica." But I could get the real one if I wanted to. It's like dungeon with a record. Okay, because <laughs> I'm a big Bobby Heenan mark. Undefeat. If you want a good comparison Brittany. to who Bobby Heenan is, kidnap no, nope, not at all. Brittany Young returns. She's so cute. Jeremiah yeah, she is awesome. back. And Brittany, we haven't seen you since the Jader Paramo match, and I know you were bummed about it. And I saw even in the intro, you were kind of shaking your head about it, knowing there were a couple ones that you had. So since that match, you and I heard you on, on backstage afterwards too. You wanted to come back, and now you do against Chris Jericho. How are you feeling coming into this match? I'm feeling good. I mean, honestly, Jader and my's match was so much fun. I had a blast. So even though I lost, I still came back because I got pride. I got the knowledge. I'm ready to go. So, okay, so Brittany, I didn't know you're this. obviously well known uh, for I, I was, a variety of like, roles. Let me not Google the her for a second. The she is born in uh, Tokyo, and Japan. I'm Oh, really? thinking during some so measure of shooting, you and the cast got together Asian... and you watched some wrestlers and saw how they uh, performed and their moves. Did Chris or Jericho is she more like name ever Polynesian? come up on set? And if so, was it met with astound and praise? Her or father was it met is African-American and her mother is white. Um, 
It was met okay. with a mixture of both, but that's I will say mixed. that's because okay. we had the but amazing Chavo Guerrero Jr. Cool. who told us all kinds of behind the scenes secrets, tidbits. Um, but no, we love Jericho over at Glow. He's had some of our girls on his podcast, yep. so we appreciate him being a fan. And obviously we're a fan of his, so, you know, it's all love. It's all love. Well, Brittany, good luck to you. And I know that well, Kaiser, one last question for you. Kaiser and Roxy obviously have this thing. Do you take any of that going into because knowing their feud that you're trying to win an extra one here, or you just can't think about it and you've got to focus on Jericho? open up the window. Um, I mean, I want to say I can't think about it, but I just was informed and you guys. Uh, intro, my friend Renko, also known as Canada Rocks season, in so, the, you know, trying to yeah. throw in the thing. He, oh, he's he's so right. on the wrong well, faction. Good luck to you, Brittany. We'll see you just a moment. <laughs> I don't know Ryko, but from what I've seen him on Impolite Truth, the dude's awesome. Representing he is also a Canadian. Stars. Yeah, I, I caught that. Yeah, I was like, right on. Of zero wins, one defeat. He is the champion, the demo god, Chris Jericho. I'm sitting here for over ten minutes listening to all of this. I also love Rossi's. Blah, 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 blah. So, I mean, Kaiser's promo really was terrible. He read it off the telephone. You have a rock star right here. You say, like could have easily asked him. Circle came back from Judas. Terrible stuff. Thank That's goodness Brittany Young is here. The only person in the class on this entire show. Because he's, he's Next the time, artist. You put me on first the next time. You understand me? I don't need to sit here for nine minutes listening to Christian Harloff and I love how he's like, I'm going to put my own belt in the background. Jeez Louise, you got the champion here. Put me he holds on, the record. I think he still holds the record want, for the most uh, intercontinental title wins show? in WWE history. Put me on first. I also uh, like our apologies. the ACDC our apologies in the background. To the oh, dude, the huge, huge Not, not meaning to step on any yeah. toes here as we, we I mean, are getting... We're excited to have poster, you back, Chris. Real quick. But, uh, yeah. uh, like, I know that how much... I know how competitive you are. I know how that match against Smith... I fangirled out when he had... You made it very clear that the Kevin Smith category... I know, shouldn't have been on the wheel, but nonetheless... You I said Paul Stanley, Gene Simmons. Fix that was. I think he had Tommy well, Fair, no, and I know he had Bruce Kulick with version him. of uh, Schmodown. A rigged oh Schmodown. Um, I'm taking this to the Supreme Court. They leave the, the business on yet. Screen Junkies. Fair is enough. Also well, uh, there's yeah. unfortunately yeah. no yeah. recaps yeah. left in that particular match, but you have a whole here. new day here against Brittany Young. So how do you prepare yeah, yeah, against a competitor like Brittany Young? Well, my amazing manager, Roxy Stryer, has been giving me lots of pointers. We're watching a lot of movies. Uh, via StreamYard and Zoom. She kind of does the, the John Madden thing where we pause it, rewind it. She has a thing that draws on the screen so you can see like the different looks and, and lines and faces and special effects. So I feel quite prepared. Um, did a lot of studying for the, I'm sure, the inevitable Brittany Young category. A little, uh, You're going to stick up there like you did last time with the Kevin there. Smith category. So mm -hmm. I know all about her. I'm ready. I'm probably more ready now than for anything I've ever been involved with in my entire life. You know, you're a real tough guy behind that Zoom. I really wish this was actually live. Uh, first of all, it's StreamYard, so get it right, buddy. I thought, I don't know, I, I'm, I'm not good Ooh, with technology. Exactly. We got Brandon Hanna to figure that out. You know, you and I are actually more alike than you think, okay? Oh, completely. We both love heavy metal music. <laughs> right. We both have eccentric pets. You've got a platypus, I've got a pig. Yep. And like Ric Flair said, we both got houses on the big side of town, so we're not all that different. No, we, I'm actually, the first thing I noticed is that you also have some rock and roll records behind you, as do uh, I. Pyromania so 5150. We actually right have on. some uh, decor here, not just a bare empty wall. So it does put us on the same plane. And I'm not here to fight with anybody. It's Kaiser I'm here to win. That's what I'm winning him right now. All right. Good luck. It's gonna be. It's listen. I hope. I hope Harloff didn't put you up at the motel. I, six I like hope he normally that does. Uh, the guy's we get got a zero Piggy Smalls. No, thank you. Uh, yeah, I got motel five. Cameo. It's one worse. Yeah, I gave you the yeah. five. All right. So Chris, bring him back. Be careful with that All button. Right. All right. Well, Brittany Young is back. Chris Jericho has arrived. Mark, both of our competitors right. have entered the virtual what battlefield. Give us didn't fall asleep in the can. Round number one. <laughs> round number one I think works you had to as walk thus. To the, the field uh, of place competition will hear eight oh, questions oh, yeah. from eight different corners of movie, trivia, okay. showdown, and I know should how. Each question is worth one Me point. Two. There is no penalty for missing a question. And there is no stealing, at least not in round number one. As soon as we ask the question, each competitor has 15 seconds to write down their best attempt at an answer with whatever parchment you have handy on whatever utensil you prefer. 
Once we ask you by name or nickname, please show what you wrote to your camera at the same time you verbalize your attempt into the microphone. I remind each competitor, if you need to repeat the question, you want to buy yourself another 15 seconds at any point throughout the match, you have three JTE rules to do that. JTE rules, not originally named for one of our competitors today, but if they co-opt it, who are we to do? Yeah. You also each have one challenge to be utilized at any point throughout the three-round match. It, it needs to fit, stay you can for, simply uh, say challenge. We'll bring in your manager, you talk it over, yeah, they'll Ecuadorian, confirm and ratify uh, yeah. that said Podcaster challenge is GD. taking I love place. It when Christian, does that. I think we're yeah. about <laughs> ready to get going. Look at the focus on these faces. All I right, love, too, so when they were saying, Brittany, oh, should we ready? change it? Thank you for asking. Uh, JTE's like, Chris, well, I have my lawyer on standby, and it was a picture of Gucci. Yes! Let's get ready! to Schmodown. Round number one. Question number one in the realm of action adventure. Which actor plays the title character in the 1979 film Mad Max? Here we go, Christian. Looks like Chris Jericho was powering up before the match. Mel Gibson! Hey, he's back! Good timing! Great out. Oh, a little bit of unpreparedness. Four. Three. Thank you for two, wearing your mask. One pens down, hands up, please, and we start with Brittany. I have to. Mel Gibson. Yes, I Chris. It. I gotta write bigger, but Mel. Ooh. Mel Gibson. I can, say it. I can say it. One, one. All right. Next question mark. Well, I didn't miss well, that. Can see it. It's fine. Your next category is in the world of the 1980s, 80s movies. And your question: What 1980s family film? Features such characters as Chunk, Ooh. Mouth, Hello. Data, and Sloth. Is there not a dress code on Schmodown? I'll wait till the. We, we actually require shirts, so I'm happy that Chris wore some garb. You guys are just showing a lot four, of skin three, with the V and the. Great. <laughs> two, one. Pens down, please. Pens down, please. And we start with Jericho on this one. Goonies. Hey, I gotta write this. Yes. The Goonies. And Brittany. My favorite movie, The Goonies. Oh, right on. That's there it is. All right, question really three. Late, but I do enjoy question it. three. Oh, fun. All right, this is yeah. in the realm of dramas. It's a fun movie. Kurt Russell plays the character of John Ruth, also known as the Hangman, in what 2015 mm. Quentin Tarantino film? I, I believe it's pronounced Hangman. Oh, I don't How'd know. You say that? Well, you say. Bo uh, Boba Fett. So get, give me a break, yeah. will you? I'm from the South. That's how his name is pronounced down there. Me too. Five. People in the South know how it's pronounced. Four. Three. Two. One. This is wrong. Hands down, please. Starting with Brittany. The Hateful Eight? Yes. Yep. Chris Jericho. The Hateful Eight? Hateful wrong. Eight. Yep. All right. So we see ourselves now with a score of 3 3 as we get it's into good thing our I was fourth question. I was just like, Neither it's wrong, but I, all I can yet, think of Chris, is that's not just because I'm showing all of my chest. Your next category the world of romantic comedies, or as I call them, rom coms. Which actor plays Pat Solitano Sr., the father of Bradley Cooper's character in Silver oh. Linings Playbook? Starting from the fifty, did you get your food? Yeah, tense battle right. right now between the two. Food. What'd you get? They're yeah. locked in. They're focused. They're they're pizza? What do you think? All right, five, four, yeah, three, two, one. Pants down, please. And Bobby Chris. Bobby. Bobby. I didn't get yeah. it. <clears throat> Jeff Bridges. That is incorrect, Brittany. Jeff Bridges. Robert De Niro. Chunks of light yes, come out of nowhere. Correct. And Brittany goes up them by one. Brittany going up by one as we get to <laughs> our next question. Have you guys seen question. that? Yeah. Uh, uh, fantasy Sci-Fi. Did you prefer Chunk. Stardust? Yes. <laughs> nope. Fantasy Sci-Fi. What 1980s sci-fi film involves synthetic beings called replicants? Ooh. Oh, come on, seriously? Yeah, I, mean, I might as well just give myself the point now. <laughs> Jericho with the speed of an Eddie Van Halen, Brittany Young playing it like slow and Eric Clapton. And five. Uh, I, I, I had it, and then when Three. you said, I know, it was like it escaped Three. for a second, and then One, it came back. Hands down, <laughs> hands down, hands up, hands down, hands up, and we start with Brittany. The wrong Demolition Man. That's incorrect, Chris Jericho. Demolition Man. Uh, Oh. That is correct. Blade Runner it is. So Chris Jericho ties it back up here. I love the game. As we get to a score of 4-4 four, 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 getting into our next question. Hey, I got a 4-4. Four, four, it's a good so match far. on the screen. Like, Behind the scenes, Christian should never be allowed to better. use a phone while competing or announcing. 
Your next category oh, you is comedy. You guys are right? What comedies? Four, I think. Plays wealthy party animal Al Chervik in the 1980 classic Caddyshack. I got it. Christian, we're asking some good questions about some I like great these questions. flicks here. I'm liking yeah. it. Five. I might be four, wrong. Three. Me too. Two. One. Right the gauge your field, baby. And yeah. Chris. Oh, makes Where sense. Where do you get a jacket like that, Farkas? Did you get a I had Steve Martin suit with that jacket? I, I, I put John Candy. <laughs> <laughs> well done, Ronnie Dangerfield. It is. And Brittany? Chevy Chase. Oh, Jericho takes the lead here. Yeah, not a bad guess. I was thinking Chevy Chase in my head. Jericho sees himself up now. One point. Let's get like to the our name next question. Coming. Horror thriller. Horror thriller. Which thriller from director Martin Scorsese follows a U.S. Marshal whose investigation leads him to a hospital for the criminally insane? Ooh. Um, Christian to reference I personally Caddy like Shack. I'm happy to be I the one know, Chris Jericho's out. But I could be wrong. I'm, I, have a Guys, I, have a I have a guess. I know that something good. Nice. What could it be? Congrats. Five, four, probably chocolate. Three. Send it to me. Two. It's Christmas. One. Shutter Island. Hands down, yep. please. Yeah, okay. And we start with Brittany. I was wondering if it's my Sorry. life. Yes. And Chris. <laughs> Damn it. I could remember. I just said something island. So. Oh, so so we get tied Why up. are we going back and forth? This is not how it works. Back and forth we go. It is Actually, a time. Yeah, it is five five. my tongue. No. So that last question. It's our last question here. And to tie it up or to go in the lead. Here we go, Mark. What do we got? It is the category of animated Wait, films. What question could is this? Could be classic eight, movies, eight, could be eight, drawn eight, on a computer. Eight, eight. Right, eight, 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 eight. Up Which rules. classic Disney film was based on a novel by Felix Salton, which follows the life of a young deer growing up in the forest? Me. Seriously. Well, well these are one question. Grew up in an urban environment. Well, these days, with some of these movies, you never know. So I, get, so, uh, five, I end round one four, with five. Three. <laughs> Me too. Two. I have a seven. One. Pens down, please. Hands up. And we start Bambi. with Brittany. R.I.P. Bambi's mom, Bambi. I got a super Chris. round. Yeah, R.I.P. Bambi's mom. All right. So now we have a six, six score going so far. into round number two. What a battle it is so oh, no. far. And oh, Mark, I'm round just number one two. Below Rules. Them. How do you I, go? Will Dead I beat them? At the top, oh, yeah, Christian did. Brittany Young succeeding despite her manager Kaiser. Chris Jericho inspired by his manager Roxy. See, and this is Round why number I two, can't each competitor gets a spin at because... the wheel. You just spin it with your mind. It is the digital this is why I don't do man agent in which we live. I don't do Once you settle on a category, you um, get four questions. These questions are asked I'm just telling you how many questions I got right. Do I need you. to do like each question for two points, points if I get a second round However, question right? However, stealing is available. I'll just do it by question. Yeah, I'm just going to do it by how many I answered correctly. Ask yeah. us for multiple choice. Yeah, because the we math is involved options, and I don't One of which we think is the correct answer. Also, you're point, answering the both the of those questions. Yeah, exactly. Down yeah. to one, but it does at least prevent That's your opponent possibly from stealing two points. So, Christian, it's deadlocked at the top. And as much as Chris Jericho did not like being introduced second, that does mean that he has the choice if he would like to spin the wheel first or defer to his opponent, Brittany Young. So for that decision, Chris, you and Roxy Stryer have 60 seconds to determine said conundrum. First of all, hi, Chris. You're doing an amazing job. This Thank is awesome. you. Thanks, Chunk. Yeah. Oh, you got Chunk. it all day. Best nickname ever. How are you feeling? Do you feel I, like you're going to the second really highest call, opinions if you want it? Well, yeah, that's why you're yeah, here. I think yeah, I mean, that like, it. would be better for us to see yeah. first, because then just in case she ends up with a choice, we'll be able to give too. her she said, anything what? that we want to give her, and it won't take it off the wheel for I said, what's your favorite type of pizza? I think that we should go first. I'm feeling confident right now. You've got some momentum in your corner, too, so I think we spin first. That's it. I always listen to my manager. We go first. Over here, every single do it. You got this, baby. Don't forget, Copping costs rules, more. So, need them to repeat the question. Oh, that, that's um, the same here. Our yeah, right? time, you got that. But, so you got uh, three Hawaiian of those in the whole game. Is my favorite. Well, Hawaiian is Let's spin great. This wheel, see what we it's got. It's not my go-to, but it is good. The, and we wait, have wait, wait a minute. How many types of pizza are called, there? Uh, the the Jericho is totally excellent. Hawaiian is ham and pineapple. That's right. That's just like last time. I remember that. Hey, mine's pepperoni, cheese, and bacon. And I don't like pepperoni. Okay. Oh fuck! I get remember. Two of those three are not out here. Here is the spin. Which one? The pepperoni? Here it is. Pepperoni and bacon. I, only yeah. orange, I also don't like bacon. That's kind of weird. 
So I do find it. Yeah, it's yeah. yeah. choice blooming. <laughs> Although, no, I wouldn't because I love pork. Lands on famous actors and actresses. 60 seconds. I'll allow it. How do you feel about this? Another so thing you want to really in? It's a pretty broad category, but wow, um, that sucks. I just want to know how you're feeling. Um, because once you have bacon, it'll change it. your life cool forever. Pretty much all the categories. I, yeah, yeah, bacon. I agree. I, I, I agree. Bacon bacon bacon. Bacon. I don't like it. Please. Perfect. Let's respin it. No matter what it is, you've got I'll, this. I'll eat the bacon. You bacon, need to get a multiple choice ham. for that yeah. one point. Do that. One of the best things I've ever had when I went back to Quebec a couple years ago is called a pizza déjeuner, which translates to breakfast pizza. But essentially, on a pita bread, it's cheese hollandaise sauce, eggs, bacon, and sausage. So dramas it is. And now we are going to bring in and we start here. Chris, you're going to have four questions in the room. I know how to live. Dramas. You have all your JTEs you know how to left, eat. and here that, That's we why go. we're uh, fat over on this all side right. of the world. Yeah. <laughs> hey, I'm not exactly an athlete. Who stars as the explorer Percy Fawcett in the biographical drama film The Lost City uh, of Charlie Z. Hunnam. Isn't it, Ma I thought it was, I thought it was Matt Smith. Um, if I don't know it... Can you I go to multiple choice? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Multiple choice. All right. Is it A, Robert Pattinson? B, Rami Malek? Robert Pattinson. C, Jeremy Renner? D, yeah, well, Charlie well, Hunnam? Well, I'm going to say um, Rami Malek. It is incorrect. Brittany, for the steal, you're going to get the question first and the options. Who stars as explorer Percy Fawcett in the biographical drama film The Lost City of Z? Is it A, Robert yeah, Pattinson? If you B, watch Rami other Malik, movies C, other Jeremy than Twilight, Renner, D, Robert Charlie Pattinson Hunnam. is a very good actor. D, Charlie Hunnam. Correct for one no point. Saying, big steal there. You've never there. even heard of that stupid What movie. did they say? Charlie Hunnam? Here's the second. And point. I hate Charlie Hunnam. Yep, I was right. Sorry. Sorry. Pattinson is in the movie, but he's not the star. It's Here's okay. The it's okay. All right. Al Pacino plays Lieutenant. Uh, Colonel Frank oh, Slade, He's blind. who has what disability in 1992 sent of a woman? He's blind. I believe. Two points. That's a good movie, by the way. All right. Here you go. You like smelling women? Next one. Good moves. Thank you. All right. Thanks. Chris, really celebrating a that blind That is a personal guy. question, 50. Sorry. Where's Sturger? She's on this thing. When is she coming up? She'll be doing the post interviews. Oh, okay. <laughs> Uh, who stars said, as I don't talk painter to you guys. Margaret Keane in Tim Amy Burton's Adams. Big Eyes? Is Big Eyes good? I don't know. Hel Helena Bonham Carter. I haven't seen Big Eyes. And is incorrect. For two reason points I know this here, is Brittany. because who I gave plywood to one of the set Margaret dad designers Keen when they were filming this movie Tim Vancouver. Big Eyes. Hmm. Amy Adams? For two more points. Big steal. Wow. Big steal. So, so I you know, that Brittany likes watching too bad for my taste, so I never watched it. What are you doing? Oh, here. You're about to make me show my sweatpants on TV. <laughs> I got my sweatpants. I got my sweatpants on. We're having a dance party later, you guys. Are we are, whether you like it or not. I'm down. Right, here's the four. Here's the last question. <laughs> what na What 1991 film Fried stars Kathy Bates and Jessica Tandy and tells parallel stories about Alabama women during two different time periods? Mm -hmm. All right, for f sake, do so I look like the type of guy that's gonna watch a Jessica Tandy movie? <laughs> Give me multiple yeah. choice. All right, is it A, Steel Magnolias, B, Fried Green Tomatoes, C, I would have gotten it with the own. multiple choice, D, but I wouldn't have gotten people. it as the two-pointer. Fried Green Tomatoes. Yeah. For one yeah, point. I got it as the two-pointer. Boom! So, all right, so Young has and Jericho are tied now. Nine, nine. Nine nine. Oh, nine. nine. As we now nine. remove Chris, we're gonna bring in <laughs> so Kaiser. If you guys are ever interested in reading seconds. a biography what did you that's this with mud? out of your wheelhouse, I God, I'd recommend Jericho's first one. You think you could figure out line how to read a coffee. It's really good. Anna. What's it called again? You can have him back. Uh, 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 it uh, covers up until Brittany, I believe you know his debut in WWE down. in 1999, and then there was another one after that that covers his WWE stuff. the lead singer of Skid Row. You clearly have a lot of knowledge. You're 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 the champion. He he's the champion in, in French Canadian or whatever language his parents spoke French Canadian uh, before they moved to the United States. But you got Shut this. Up, I love you. Your game is getting better. 
don't be afraid. Hey, you got all your Jason. Can I, can I, can I, can I hear you? Right? Yeah, that buys you a little more time, right? Oh, for sure. Right? Yeah. I love him, Jason. I wish he had more wings, though. Luther shaves his head. He was one of our biggest. If Luther wasn't there, he'd be my favorite. He was one of our biggest advocates. Here is the wheel. As Brittany now will have her spin. And now they're turning him to shut up. Good for you. Yeah, but I argue like brothers, I guess. No, I'm kidding. You're supposed to say fair enough, but I'll forgive you. That's gonna be on my gravestone. I follow Christian on Instagram. He shaved his head. That that counts for something. Not respin. Uh, that would be a respin. There is a um. And here is two spins left still. This anime. Oh, I have a inside joke with some of my friends. That is fair enough. But it's in a different way. So no, 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 no. Oh, screwed. Tarantino. So, so it's funny uh, that uh, wait, wait, have another that fair enough exists in different uh, I mean, friend groups for different yeah, reasons. Yeah, <laughs> yeah let's reset. Oh, it. God, right. I was like, it goes around it's, and a, around. it's a very yeah, common phrase. Yeah, whatever Brittany gets here, she's got to take. I'm not well versed in Tarantino, we so. Yeah. I really don't like Tarantino. You know, it's all the fans watching. This oh, no. is not actually part of a bus. Well, now, Hannah, he was, uh, oh. he made coffee for Spinner's the show. Spinner's Choice! Spinner's Choice! Spinner's Choice! Disney, 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 Disney! Disney, Disney, Disney. Right. so, Brittany, you can choose 60 seconds deciding now. How's your, how's your day been? <laughs> Man, I gotta tell you, I'm working on a, I'm working on a real, uh, real piece of trash show. Uh, I don't want to get into it right now, but, Gucci verse. Uh, I'm no, happy to be here. With, listen, I'm happy to be here with you. I'm happy. No, he's to actually be works competing. It's our final match. Yeah. The Dungeons had a great year. He, he worked on. I mean, what was it that? Was it the rankings, Bachelor show, or was better. it was something along the lines? I know, of I know that. you're getting better. I know you like this game. I know the Jader Palermo, whatever his name is, the Miami Palermo. Muskrat. That's all in your rearview mirror. What do you like here? Hey. I know it's only two. There's two things you like. So what do you, what do you feel about? I'm in Miami. I'd love to go with Disney. <laughs> All right, let's just do it. Disney? Let's do it Disney. for Bandy. All right. Yeah, yeah. Disney is. Yeah. Perfect right, Disney game. Disney is going to remove Kaiser. And now we're going to get give him a spot. Do you have a four questions in the realm of Disney films. Disney films. That's All right. right. Brittany Young looking to take a sizable lead into round number three. As bad as Brandon Hanna is at making coffee, that's how well <laughs> Brittany Young has played thus far. See if she can continue the streak. In the world of Disney films, Brittany, for two points, who plays real life composer Richard Sherman oh. in 2013? Yeah. Saving yeah. Mr. Yeah. Banks. You're saying BJ Novak, Ben? Yeah. Okay. It's Jason Schwartzman. Uh, Novak's the other one. Can you know okay. Yeah, she can. You Novak is may. Robert uh, Sherman. Your four asshole. options for one point is it A, BJ Novak, B, Colin Farrell, C, Bradley Whitford, I or have D, that Jason one. Schwartzman? I need cool. to rewatch that man. movie. It's great. That is incorrect. So, oh, Chris, yeah. I'm going to repeat I, uh, the question. Jason and I'm Schwartzman. Gonna... Yeah. I don't need to, Christian, because I knew it was Jason Schwartzman. Is... I can tell who's who by the title of the personality. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I did. And animals that I did, used their parents at an un, un, a, a early age. But no, Schwartzman yeah. would win. Yeah. <laughs> All right, here's the next question. All right. <laughs> Go over to Jericho's house for a double feature of fried green tomatoes <laughs> and Saving Mr. Banks. I Your next question. the worst night of movie hell ever. Hey, Saving Mr. Banks is a great life. film. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Actually, Colin Farrell was robbed. Uh, Brittany, we go Absolutely. back to you for a two-point question in the world of Disney. In Tangled, after being denied permission to leave her tower, what does Rapunzel ask her mother to get was her a rare for flower? her 18th birthday? <laughs> Oh. No, it's a rare uh, uh, fruit that she likes to eat. Thought it was a paint mm. set. No. Can we go yeah, no, no, no. You're right. You're right. So Certainly, it's, it's your a, options for paint a point. from a very Is far away. Yeah, paint. paint. Yeah. B paint. paint. Yeah. C a gold thread. I have a three-year-old niece. A lantern. Gotcha. Uh, she loves this movie. It's been a bit since I've seen it. I've never seen it. I'm gonna go Dude, in you're missing paint. out. Why not? Any paint is correct for a point, and now Christian Ew. Brittany Young edges even with Chris Jericho. All right, here's our next question. Question three. Why? All right, your penultimate have question have in the world of Disney the films. Pizza. They kind of messed it up. Brittany, for two points, who plays the lead role? Oh, you and McGregor. Christopher Robin. Yeah. Mm -hmm. In 2018's yeah. Mm -hmm. Christopher Robin. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Reminded me of Hook. Did you like that movie? I did. I, I haven't seen it, it but I know it was Ewan. 
I, uh, category I would pick Saving Mr. Banks over that. I was one, expecting the animated decent. movies. Yeah, it's not bad. Yeah, we'll but it's probably also get there not eventually. too good. Is it A. Hugh Grant, B. Colin Firth, C. Ewan McGregor, or D. Colin Farrell? C. Ewan McGregor. That is correct. And Young vaults back Hello into the there. lead by one with Hello one there. question remaining. Hello. Brittany, to go into round number three with a possible three-point lead, here is your question. In 1955's Lady and the Tramp, hmm. what is the name of the restaurant oh. where they eat that famous spaghetti? Tony's. Tony's. <laughs> Cafe who gives a I don't think it's that. Can I have multiple choice? Five. <laughs> yes. Four. All right. Your options. Is it A, Cafe Who Gives a Cafe. No, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm in the wrong set. Here we go. Brittany, your options for a point. Matt, you're missing a, out. Bella Noche. B, Bacuzzi. Bella Noche is the name C, of the song. Alfredo's or D, Tony's. I'm going to say it's Tony's. A, Bella Noche. Uh, yeah, I definitely will. That is okay. incorrect. Okay, and so now Chris Perico, who I do not believe is a grandma? huge fan of this question, is yeah, going to be she presented wants me to get some for my grandpa for, uh, and order the options again. For. So Chris, Aww. here we go for a steal. Such a good grandpa. In 1955's Lady in the Tramp, are they gonna what is be the tied name up? of the restaurant? <laughs> so I said Tony's. Is You're right. Is it A, I think. You're correct. Bella Noche, B, Bacuzzi, Bella the name of the song. C, Alfredo's, yeah, Bella Noche's the or D, song. Tony's. I would have gotten it wrong anyways, though. They're eating spaghetti. So I'm going to say Alfredo's. It's a great guess. They're in the pasta family, but Christian, we were looking for Tony's. Ah, Tony. Yeah, you could have got Tony. So I finally I got a point. I haven't right, right, well, yet. Both, both having a struggle in the round number two, but we'll see ourselves with Brittany so, Young with a one point lead going into right round number the, three. So, I'm so far, Disney eight didn't right. go exactly the way to get. She still 16, has a one so point lead as she I'm gets six. into the final Wait, round. Yeah. All right, yeah. Mark. No, round sorry, three, how's 16. it go? Round yeah. number three. This is the no, round that uh, will italics. determine the match, unless we go to sudden death overtime, which I'm being told I, is I just still mathematically possible. So, what we need from each competitor are three numbers. These integers may range from one to 20. Each numeral corresponds to a different category of movie trivia schmodown goodness. Your first question's worth two points. Your next one's worth three points. Your final query is I'm worth five way of the better biggest points of yours than I did for. Uh, Keep in mind, there is no penalty for missing uh, a question. Star Wars. And there is no Star stealing Wars. in round number three. And My rule Brittany Young, because you if enjoy I can guess one at least ten correct questions, Jericho, I'm a happy guy. Exactly right below you on this stream. You get to give us your three numbers first. From one to 20, what feels lucky? Um, let's go with two, four, seven. Two, four, and seven for Young and for Chris. Crap numbers. I'm going uh, 18, 17, mm -hmm. <laughs> and 14. Sexy numbers. Sexy numbers. That's what I'm uh, I, I challenge, since he's not American, he has I'll... to say those numbers in French. <laughs> well, that's that's a uh, challenge. Mon no. Mange la mer. Google it. You just told him to eat shit. Can you bring me my heart pills, <laughs> Hannah? This is a tight one. I don't even want to guess who that is. Actually, right, yeah. So let's uh, now, now we're gonna have we're gonna have Kaiser talking to Brittany here for 60 seconds, starting now. So he sold him well, come mierda. The heart pills, so <laughs> they're chewable. See, si. um. How you feeling, kid? I'm okay. I gotta. Your turn, Ben. I gotta get the confidence down. <laughs> I was down. just about I was to say that, Fifty. Fifty, you and I have been on simpatico. We got that Usa thing that we. Oh, uh, us uh, together. The thing that the the Maharishi, what is it, whatever is the video we watched on YouTube. Just get zen with it. Mm -hmm. You I'm, got this. You're gonna beat I'm this. I had a good time. Listen, he got he got beat by a guy who wears a, a, a raincoat to the beach. I mean, how good can he be? Let's go. You got this. All right. Thanks. All right, now we're going to get to Roxy. 60 seconds starting now. Uh, quickly, Rish Faron. You know what that is? Tell me. Wealthy pharaohs in French. Man, Just you saying. Are, you are smart. I'll give you that. Not, You're a smart not guy. Too um, I don't understand a word that comes out of Kaiser's mouth, to be honest. <laughs> Chris, this is your game to win, period. You've got this. It is. Complete losing. We're not doing it again. We have three questions to get this in the bag. Um, just remember that if you need to repeat the question, you need a little more time. You have three JTE rules, so you can use those in case you need them. Um, keep in mind, it goes two, three, five. So 
if you've got the knowledge in your head, it will be there. Don't, if it doesn't come to you immediately, don't panic. Just let it come to you. Okay. Stay let it get All there. your JCs, oh, sis. All your I got this, man. I got this. I know you do. I know you do. Let's do this for the Rockstars, baby. All right, Chris. You chose category 18. You chose remakes and reboots for your two-pointer. Here it is. Different. Oh, different. Jeff Goldblum yeah. plays scientist Seth Brundle the in what horror remake? Yeah, I was so fly. The Fly. I was gonna, Two I was points. Chris Jericho that, takes the lead. So now we bounce to Brittany Young, who has her. I don't watch horror movies. Anymore. I haven't That's seen right. it either, but it's like enough, Christian. She oh. selected yeah. number two for that two pointer. And here we go, Brittany. You selected the category of crime movies. Okay. And for two points, and to reclaim the lead. Who stars as Debbie oh, Sandra Ocean Bullock. Come on. in yeah. Ocean's Eight? Sandra Cindy Bullock. B. Christian, Brittany Young, just like the stream would indicate, back on top. I love you, Chris. I love you, Chris. I like that bouncing movie. Back. Yeah, I, wouldn't yeah, sure. that I wouldn't have got that one. Okay, Bounce. that is a good movie. Watch it. Yeah, no, it's good. It's good. They are bouncing back and forth here. And here is, Chris, your next category. You chose category 17 in the realm of horror movies. Yes! Horror movies. Right. Yay. Who plays... Horror film fanatic oh, Randy um, Meeks in the Scream franchise. Shit! I can picture him. Jamie. What is his name? And then, um. Scar God, is it? No, no. Megan. Jamie, Jamie Kennedy. Yeah. Fuck, I couldn't pull wow. the name. Correct, for three points. Jericho <laughs> went the pole. Wow, you're Jericho, still in, you're big still in the pull lead. there and yeah, sends it back game. to Brittany now. It is 15-13, yeah. bouncing back and, and forth they, they him, go. Uh, and now think out loud Brittany Young too. has number four, Mark, number four. Uh, that's right, Christian. Shades of Josh McCuga and Stacey Howard with that pull from Jericho. Very clutch in a big moment, but now Brittany Young, once again. I think that, that should be again, something that you can think question out loud the and then say final the answer at yeah. the end. She answers this correctly. Why they incorporated Brittany, the you selected number four for your three-point question. And that's yeah. going to correspond to the uh, world I would like of to see movie that quotes. In all of them. And sure. your question. Again, to reclaim the lead. What holiday classic features the line, worse? How could things National get any worse? Va Take a Christmas look around vacation. here, Ellen. We're at the threshold of hell. It's my Christmas go to every year. What, what am I with me? What am I with me? So, so far, I've missed both of Jericho's, but I've gotten both of uh, Five, uh, Britney's. Four, I'm so choked by Jamie Kennedy. I, as one. soon as they said it, I All pictured right. him right in my head. In the category yeah, of these movie things are going quotes, to happen sometimes. what holiday classic features the line, worse? How could things get any worse? Take a look around here, Ellen. We're at the threshold of hell. Love that line. Love that scene. Love that movie. Oh, man, mine's shitter's full. <laughs> <laughs> Five. Hey, honey, look! Four, I'm here. Three. Christmas vacation. Christian. Or yeah. she did it. She I pulled it. More surprising. Right. You stapled my like Jamie Kennedy. She <laughs> wow. got it. Wow. Wow. So, and that was what? Sixteen. Uh, Fifteen. What a pull by Young. What a pull by Jericho. And we get to our five pointer. Here is our five-pointer. Hey, really now, if Chris questions. Jericho hits it, he bounces it back to Brittany. However, if he misses, then Brittany Young will win the match. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. All right. Here we go, Chris. Are you ready for your five-pointer? Yes. All right. Which early? Yeah, is it? Uh, sorry, sorry. Disaster films. Disaster films. This is for disaster Ooh, films. Disaster. Here you go. Okay. Which early 2000s disaster film features such actors as Aaron Eckhart, Delroy Lindo, Bruce Greenwood, oh, and Richard Jenkins? Early, just think about early 2000s disaster movies. That's what Don't think about the actors first. Man of the Oh. Five. 
J T day after tomorrow. J stands for Jericho. That's not early two thousands, Ben. That was, I, that was when I was in Vancouver. What? Which early two thousands disaster film features uh, I'm trying such to think actors of the... as I might Aaron Eckhart, going to Mission to Mars Delroy Lindo, Bruce Greenwood, and Richard Jenkins? Hmm. I'm going to say Armageddon. Was Thunder uh, disaster movie? And your winner, ladies and gentlemen, Brittany Sherry Bond. Not bad, 19 for 21. The yeah. answer was the core. The core. The core. <laughs> Was the answer the core? Wow. I got Brittany Young I got defeats Le Champion Chris Jericho in I what a six. match it was because bouncing back and right, forth. Man. Here they are, and now Jen Sturger yeah, yeah. will yeah. take the yeah, yeah, interview yeah. here yeah. with Brittany oh, really? <laughs> and Kaiser. That was like Clash of the Champion Six, Ric oh. Flair versus Ricky Steamboat. That was just a slugfest. I mean, I you're obviously very, very excited. This is a little bit of redemption for the dungeon, I'm sure, for you, right? Well, yes. My, my whole life aspires to putting down and shaming Roxy Stryer. That's my oh, goal. I'm not enough you. Wins are nice, but if I can put Roxy in her place, uh, that's a good day at the office for me. I'm ecstatic. Look, Brittany is, is, a, is a fan okay. of this game. She came in with a penchant for the game. She Once she got in that studio and saw what everybody was doing, she's like, I want to be here. I want to do this. I want matches. And I'm so happy for that the cherry bomb you know dropped today me? on Chris matches. Jericho, who played a hell of a match. Ah, a hell of a ah, match. That ah, man can, I mean, plenty. he's not just some, you know, second-rate wrestler who, who found another Jay career in, in trivia. He, he's, 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 he's great. And so, I, only I, I mean, that was a hell of a match. I don't know what to say. I don't know. I mean, honestly, every show. time I say the F, F word, I, I receive a, 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 a penalty. Okay. Like, I got to turn over my check or whatever. I'm sure he's going to get away with it because Harloff is a shill for wrestling. Wrestlers. All right. Okay. Is that Anyways, the end of your back statement? To, back to Brittany. Brittany, congratulations on this match, obviously. You were a little taken back by some of those Disney questions in round two. Were you starting to get a little nervous? I was starting to get I was starting to get nervous, but Chris is right. In my mind, I was definitely thinking like Pinocchio, Beauty and the Beast. Like that's where my mind was going. Um, but yeah, no, I definitely that was so much fun. I mean you know, you never really want to come in here and be Cafe like who gives a shit somebody needs to out, be a new but like the fun competition is what is exciting. Yeah. But towards the end, there I was There's like, "There's no, a lot of I'm yeah, in the same position again." Like, you know, gonna come out of these guys' and mouths. Then, I didn't. Does this give you a little bit of confidence, especially getting back into where you're 500 now? This is a good <laughs> cup of coffee. Thank you. I mean, finally got a good. Cup yeah, of coffee. 50. We have I mean, to get yeah, you on this side does. of the world I'm to try sad some pizza. This is the dungeon's last game for the season, but like. I definitely you know, I want to uh, ride London. this going into... When the guy asked me what company do I want, back. I wanted... Um, I told him, oh, just uh, Black Olives. It's and really exciting. Like, I mean, technically, that's it? I'm two-in-one if we include my glow well, match, we just, but I'm not going to, like, had more you know, asterisk on that one. Oh, I, love I it, like I love Black it. Olives, Kaiser, but I don't know if I'd like them enough to have just have that on a pizza. Does it look like this match make you think that you're going to keep Britney next season? People have two toppings on a pizza. It's like, a lot of my players what are you doing? Out with They're rich. Playing big matches. <laughs> yeah, even if they've like lost, that. they've been losing Well, how much close. does it cost per topic? Zip's been losing close. Video Drew just went perfect um, in her match. I know, it's not that so much, but everyone's people just don't like to pay extra for something. That's the way it is. But Regardless of how listen, much uh, I know how to talk to these, these That these almost people. plays into like, the know, stereotype a little bit. They just need to be sweet <laughs> in the right way. So, well, you know, you know, it's kind of like what I told Ben. Baker. Depends on which stereotype, though, so because there's them. a Jewish stereotype and a Israeli stereotype. You want to be a winner. Well, I was thinking... Very similar, but not... Okay, I was just thinking cheap overall. I'll tell you what, not for nothing. Chris Jericho should know that Roxy won't be managing that. The stereotype is he got to Try to find candles. a way to so not pay for something. Tell him the page. <laughs> I know he still just, has a sky page. Yeah, you know, uh, I the Jewish stereotype is not paying for anything, but the Jewish stereotype is getting it um, without paying. Congratulations That's, again today, Brittany. I and, might uh, have a bit of Israeli in me, then. Kevin Smuts. We love him, and we're just, <laughs> I think there's a little bit of Israeli in all of us. True. That is, so obviously, very, very happy is Cherry Bomb, Brittany Young. And, of course, we want her back. Of course, we're going to have her back. She will be, if she doesn't sign with Kaiser again, or they don't sign her, she'll be in the draft. Either way, or she'll sign with someone else. Either way, good to know that they have Cherry Bomb back. Oh, that was a great match. A lot of back and forth, a lot of fun both competitors had. And now we have Jen Sturger, who is well, with I'm not going to eat healthy Strong. on the holidays, so around the holidays, tough, I can be a little bit better. Champion. I am so sorry. It's just like you, you get so close, and then it just kind of the wheels fall off at the end. How are you feeling right now? 
Um, Jared Jared gets gets to, um, it's kind of interview funny him a lot with AEW. Yeah. You always go back and look through and had I gotten a Tarantino or had I not spun movie, again sure. and got drama movies. When she got hired to work for AEW, I was like, that me. is... If I'd ever seen genius. or even heard of a movie called... <laughs> More people need to see her. an actor called Richard to Jenkins. Get, uh, you know, Who the hell get is bigger. that? It's forever on my uh, on my list, so to speak. So, um, do I like? I love playing I know the they game. Do I don't like the losing, kiddos, especially but with I the great management that they, of Roxy Star. Like, I feel like I let her down. In the but um, you know what? We always have a good time. Yeah, I'm me too. The most but... entertaining. I don't know what the hell that Kaiser yeah. is talking about. I don't know what that point. guy is. Yeah, yeah, I understand why he does it. But other than that, I mean, business savvy you know, is smart. We, 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 we came very close. But as an adult, I'm like, I want them to curse. Absolutely, Ross, you have something to add. I yeah, because yeah, he okay. never let me down. I mean, for Kevin to be you, he needed to have his own no, he started on the sky wheel now. and a hand it to you. <laughs> and for Brittany to beat you, she needed to spin the more on the and she still almost lost. And she just but, had a random pull. Those happen sometimes. Olive, uh, I was so glad that you were stuck in it. On the pizza. Oh. Jamie Kennedy's name, which was like, seemed so close and so Taking far at the same time, but something... you ended up getting there. Hard and honestly, in my mouth. I know it okay, sucks to lose, bad. but you're doing everything right, that it takes to be bad. one of the greats right that's now. That's what she said. Like, <laughs> you know, it's like, we just have to keep going, and honestly, it sucks. It sucks, but it well, you didn't lose the game today because of you. It was because of the wheel. Every competitor has been there before, and I'm really proud of you. I'm going to come back with a vengeance. That Jamie Kennedy poll, though, I got to hey, give it to you, Chris. That was impressive. I was trying to send Six it to you telepathically, <laughs> and well, I was like, yeah, okay. yes. The one, it was only for one point, but the one that I didn't get was was I, the Shutter Island one. I just said Island. That's another one where it's like, ah, oh, it's right in the tip of my tongue. But um, yeah, she pulled out that uh, Christmas yeah, vacation. Really. Had she not pulled that out, it, it would have okay. gone differently. I, like, it wasn't my favorite. But, um, it, was a, it was a great matchup, you know? And, you regret uh, spinning away from dramas? I no, mean, I spun away from it was, dramas. Yeah, I re, do you regret spinning away the first time two was, dramas? If, yeah, famous a actors and actresses yeah. probably would have been a little bit better than dramas, maybe. I don't um, know it's a tough category because you never know where they're going to pull from. So. Right, right. And dramas, you've seen so many dramas. It just depends on the questions. Jen, you've seen this comment yeah. again on the show. Like, it just depends. And today, those dramas weren't your dramas. But that doesn't mean that another round you wouldn't go perfect in I drama. I mean, like, Paulo Yama's good at classics, but then we saw Last Spectacular how this, how that he whiffed on that. Oh, we've now. seen like, Mark Riley whiff on scores and soundtracks. You know, prior yeah. to this, the scores and soundtracks I kept a So it happens. Wars, yeah, I've seen, uh, I've seen, I remember Clark once whiffed on horrors. the upcoming match, we're hmm. here to play. We're here to win the belt, and there's no other option, Jen. So in yeah, genre, I would be lying if I said I was nervous, but I feel really confident somewhere. in the odd yeah. couple, and I feel like we're going to take home that team's belt, and we're going to do it with pride. Like Disney, Listen, Chris, you're not done here. We're not. If it was all animated movies, movies she would have gotten down. it. But they went into but the I gotta other ask Disney you, who movies. Who do you want next? Do you still want that rematch with Kevin Smith? No, because Disney means Absolutely. animated and live action. And it's funny that, exactly. that I didn't know you were going to be. Yeah, on but when you think when you think Disney for, forever, so like your mind always goes. Yes, Kevin Smith. Maybe there should there be a separate a rematch. Disney animation with the Chris Jericho category. I'm not going to rest until that happens. Who the hell would do that? What a fix. Lily's in the Legend Not yet, no. His band of Mary Lou's doing that. They didn't do it today. Brittany was great. Yeah, Listen, Brittany's in Alaska. She hasn't seen her boyfriend in eight months. So she deserves the win. She needs it a lot more than I do. She did a great job. She's an awesome person. Smith, don't feel the same way. you now. Smith, Smith, I've been in two movies that he directed. He was he was a tyrant on set. I want revenge against Smith. <laughs> Honestly, I'm oh, the same shoot. way. I'm ready to take Smith him on. Smith versus Sheridan is coming up. Well, I don't know that about him. Yeah, well, don't I think I know someone that can make that match happen again. Sorry about the loss today, Chris and time. Roxy, but we'll see you again soon. Absolutely. Thanks, Jen. <laughs> Bye, guys. Filmed in Vancouver. Right, thank you, there Jen. You Great to see that reunion there, man. And, and look, it's it's always happy. We're always happy to see oh, okay. two people who are really into it and just going back and forth. And the pull of Jamie Kennedy, the pull of it's Christmas not vacation. Change that name. What a great match it was! And Cherry Bomb taking well, the not. victory here yep. over Chris Jericho. Also happy to hear that Jericho is going to be back next season. He'll of course what be the in the draft, unless of course Roxy Stryer decides to sign him as one of her three. The question is, will Chris Jericho be anyone else besides Roxy? 
Fox story that we do not know. And we won't know that until we find out what happened. But they already lost eight. that Mark, because that's Roxy only was in a previous match out of six. And now she was we in a different match in a completely a different location. And we're going to see Schreier. She ain't done yet. No, she is not. Chris She's watching the Mighty Ducks. All she wrote for Chris Jericho and Brittany Young in the Schmodown Spectacular. <laughs> Five with Young taking the victory 16 to 15 as much of a nail biter as they come. <laughs> and now Roxy Stryers, the odd couple, will go up against Coy, Janders. I don't know Marks, who I'm rooting for in this one because Shazam. I love both teams. It's going to be a good one, Christian. And all you folks at home, we'll be back in just a moment. I'm also turned. I'm always happy when Mark and Draco wins, but I hate it when Snyder wins. I love Snyder. Yeah, I love to hate Snyder. Ah, I can't wait. <laughs> for the Mighty Duck? <laughs>